What's going on, everybody? Willie D. Jarnett, uh, again, unscripted. Today, I want to tie this video is how to optimize your Pinterest profile. And we're going to optimize Pinterest boards, too. I'm going to show you how to do that, too. But what I want to do, I just want to give you a little bit of an update of where we are so so far since I've been kind of tinkering with this this uh, this account that I use just to find out what people are actually clicking on uh, what people are actually searching for and then you can create your pins and your blog posts around these things okay let's just go to the an analyst right here so far and if you look at my previous video we started uh, doing things now you look at these are somebody else's pin you see those pins are starting to get some clicks here guys you see that those pins starting to get some click so what that does it takes uh, the homework assignment where you have to really really research to find out what people are kind of looking for you can go in and find it just create you a profile you you might want to use this later on but create your profile pin somebody else's pins that are that are number one the first five to ten pins number one and see what traffic they started getting so we'll just look at a few of these pins let's go more just to look at more yeah let's look at a little bit more so we see this uh, tips for blogging so we'll take a look at what that looks like so you can get an idea what that is that's an infograph uh, type of a pin and you can create that and it, it you know you can come in and create your own thing and take a look at the content the site where uh where that come from you know and this is the kind of stuff that uh you have to these are the people you got to beat out to get traffic to your site this is a very very well organized blog here guys so i'm just showing you this is what this is what attracting people so you got to research research your niche so if you're going to go into this particular niche this is the kind of competition you're going to be dealing with and the reason why I, I want to emphasize this man on this Pinterest account <clears throat> I'm with this Pinterest marketing man most of these people that are on Pinterest are buyers so you just can't throw up anything you just can't throw up junk you have to have something to attract them so that's the best way to do to research it let's go to the next pin uh, that's a keyword search true let's just go to one more 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 pin that, that, that those pins have got two clicks so far I've only been doing this what I built this uh, Pinterest site what 11 days and started getting a little traffic to it look at this one 10 must have WordPress press plugins so that's another site uh, that you can go to and look at and see what's going on so if it will ever load yeah so this is this these are things that you can take a look at so just kind of giving you a little update on that now let's get to optimizing our profile man this is where our profile is <clears throat> now a lot of people has come in and has spammed this profile so they cut the characters down and I'm gonna just put some in here and show you see they cut the characters down so you your 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 profile is 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 there now what I should have did is I should have made my username one of these profile names that's fine we're, we're going we're gonna to deal with it, you know, because when I created this, I didn't know I was going to use this as a, a test uh, Pinterest account to teach you guys. So those are the two keywords I want to uh, I have as I, as I optimized. And the reason why I got that, like I told you, I went with this long tail pro. These profiles right here, um, these these two words, because it's an authority site, less competition for it. So let's get to the main purpose of this uh, video and what we're gonna do now we've got a few boards created I don't create a few more boards since you guys has been gone and before we go into the profile optimization let me show you one other thing that will happen once you start your Pinterest account now you see this board right here blogger tips and trick this was a board that 
sent me an invite to to collaborate with what that means is i can post pins in this board now think about it guys you look right here it is 519 followers this uh particular pinterest account is very brand new i only have uh let me see followers i only have 99 followers because i just started this count 10 days ago so I got 99 followers and what happened is someone wanted to collaborate with me. I know some big marketers only collaborate with high number of uh, collaboration boards. Me, I'm a little bit different. If I'm starting off a brand new uh, Pinterest account, I try to collaborate with people within the niche that I'm trying to you know, work with. And so I can get more traffic. When you start pinning to boards that's already got people there, then it, it, a, a chance for you to uh, get some traffic helps out. Okay, let's go. Let's go ahead and optimize. We're just gonna optimize this one, guys. We're gonna optimize uh, this one right here. Bloggers for beginners. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this word right here. And I'm going to show you how you optimize this. Let's go up here to this search engine right here. Look at there. You got bloggers for beginners, bloggers for beginning ideas. You know, so let's just go ahead and click this. Bloggers for money, bloggers for WordPress, bloggers for... You got those keywords, you can go in and do that. So uh, let's just go back here and... Uh, and then I'm gonna give you another tool. Just look at look at the link right here, and it's PinterestKeywordsTool.com. Here, I've already typed it in there. I'll just show you what it does. And I don't know how this this guy has a script, and his focus is to get you to click on these AdSense banners. So if you're able to find out where he got this script from, you can do this yourself. Okay, look here, the same thing. So you can come right in here and you don't want to spam what you can do but let's go back to the profile I'm gonna show you how you do this guys really really quick we can come in here because we hadn't we had done this let's go ahead and edit this and I haven't even selected what type of board this was you won't have really a credit card uh, category so always place it in others so about this board let's just go right here bloggers for beginners spacebar let's come over here let's go bloggers beginners for money and oh I said that wrong bloggers oh, let me go back to that. bloggers for beginning we go right here and I always cap guys I always cap that's just me me I uh, I do three I always do three because you don't want to stuff that you don't want to be considered a spammer that's what Pinterest do not like and ideas I think I want to do bloggers step by step I think I want to do, and that's gonna be it guys oops keep going there uh. Now I'm gonna keep that a small b. That's it, guys. Here we go. Just that quick. Now you got three choices <clears throat> that they can uh, look you up. Now the one thing that I, I will do, and I have this. Let's let me log out of this account. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you a little trick. Let's log into one of my other accounts. We'll log into this. This is what the, the Gmail account is to this one is. So let's, we'll do that. What I'm going to show you guys is, you see this link right here? You can come in and you can index this link. 
to where this will show up in a search engine. Now I got this saved in my in my in my, my bookmark. Get link index. You look for Google Webmaster Submit, and you can see the link right here. And I'll scroll the video up so you can see that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to place that link in there, and I'm going to submit it to be indexed. You need to do all your optimized boards like that. All right. And see what's going to happen, guys. When you start, people start typing in keyword, like let's say, for instance, cooking for Pinterest. Just I, I, I needed to put that in there so you can see. You see these Pinterest accounts? see these look at her look at her look at these keywords they're actually showing up in Google search look at there they're showing up in Google search I had to add that Pinterest word because I didn't have a word to pick without it but yeah these words actually show up in Google um it shows up in Google um search so that's why you want to in uh index it and uh and do that so another thing we're gonna go and look at this one now I'm gonna show you this see this right here when you create your pins come in here and put your keywords in here you can either do three keywords or you can do a just a description and then save it so guys what you're what you're doing is you're optimizing the profile you're optimizing the board and then you're optimizing the pin so you get three swings at it so guys didn't want to make this very long but I just want to show you this is my teaching of optimization I know I put a video out on the being ranked number one in Pinterest I, I got a thumb down right on right off the bat but what I, I always tell you guys that take this teaching Man, test this thing. Test this thing. See if it works for you. Just that's that's what I do. Even though I go do somebody else's teaching, test it for yourself. See if it works for you. So, guys, this is my honest way that I do this. So, I hope you like it. Um, take care, and for the many fathers tomorrow, um, happy Father's Day. Take care.